everyone, and welcome back to the Unreal World Let's Play. <coughs> so, the 3.18 beta seems to work fine. Ooh. Apparently we're really tired. Well, the beta seems to work fine, so we're going to be sticking with it for now. Banish the evil water guardian. I've never really found much use for that. Basically what it does is it makes it safer for you to swim. But it's so easy to make rafts and such that I almost never seem to swim anyway. Now somebody told me that the best way to feed our pet would be to throw food at him. I want to see if that works. Oh. Let's what, take off javelin. There. I want to see if that actually works. Oh yeah, totally does. Cool. Thanks for the tip, whoever sent that in. What was I going to do this episode? I don't even remember. How long do these have? Three, four, and five days, respectively. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to leave Bob behind. He's not needed to check the traps. Just want to see if we caught anything big. I heard something running away, but I don't know what it was. Squirrel. Okay. I don't care about a squirrel. <laughs> Sorry if my voice sounds bad today. I, like, literally just woke up. So, I thought it's still out of practice, I guess. It's the first time I've spoken all day. Well, I didn't just wake up. I woke up and took a shower and such, but... First time I've spoken all day still. Should probably start picking these up now that I have a pot. Can actually make some use of them. I don't think you can plant blueberries yet. Most plants you find in the wild you can't seem to plant, it seems like. I would like to be able to plant blueberries though. That'd be pretty neat. Well, living nearby these means that they should regrow every year on their own anyway. Not these exact plants, but the area should fill out with blueberries on their own. I think those are hallucinogenic mushrooms. Yeah. Don't want those. Might be fun to experiment with it, but I'd rather not. Also, a lot of the mushrooms have shared sprites. I don't know them by name very well, so that could well be one of the ones that will just outright kill me. Either way, I'm not interested in finding out. Mushrooms are dangerous in this game. Especially if you don't have the, um, what is it, herbalism? Herbler skill to figure it out. Yeah, we're just getting a ton of blueberries, basically. Gonna need to get some grain, too, to really do anything with them. But that shouldn't be too hard. Need to save up some money and go to town anyway. Well, not money, some stuff to trade. and go to town to get a knife anyway. So that's probably what we're going to end up doing most of this episode, is just getting trade goods. <laughs> I 
107 fists of blueberries. It's quite a lot. So what do we have? We have 35 boards. So I think I'll start with fox traps. Because they're fairly cheap and lightweight. Wow, Bob is going a bit nuts in there. Get running around in circles like that. It's weird. Okay, he's getting hungry. I don't think Bob needs to eat as much as we do. see anything moving in the distance. Hopefully that's not picking up. My hamster should decide now would be a good time to wake up and make noise. As they're prone to doing, apparently. So, back to this repetitive task. Wish you could make them in stacks. Like you can with javelins and most other craftables. I guess it's because the boards are too heavy or something. I don't know. I'm trying to justify it. Um. Eat that, Bob. Bob's very good at catching his food, I guess. I should actually drop that curved arrow. And... No. Drop the fox traps that I have already to lose the weight. Because, like I've said before, I think weight does influence your ability to actually do things properly. And I would rather make as many decent fox traps as I can. Because nobody's going to trade with me for inferior ones, really. If I get a stack of inferior ones, they might trade for it, but they're not going to be worth very much I either way. <coughs> I wonder how many of these Bob can actually carry. I think he carried 10 javelins, which are 3 each, so probably 30 pounds is Bob's carrying capacity. It's not bad. It's kind of a lot for a tiny dog. I think he is a small dog. Not like a full size one. Eat that bob. And I'll eat one. And the game will lag, apparently. And back to doing this for a bit. This is not going to be the most lively episode, unfortunately, but kind of thing that needs to get done eventually. Especially since we need a metal item and some grain. Grain itself isn't too expensive normally. But the metal stuff is usually pretty pricey. It 
even a knife will probably be a couple fox traps at minimum. And we're basically buying it so we can throw it away without getting rid of our our actual tools that we use. Our sheep is being very loud. I don't know why. I just do that, I guess. That's a pretty useful tip, though, to whoever sent it. So, what's our pile looking like? Twelve good ones and ten bad ones. That's not great, really, but I don't think we have very good skill, do we? It would be trapping? No. I'm not sure if it would be trapping or carpentry. Either way, they're pretty bad. So, not that surprising that we're making so many poor ones. Actually, we haven't made a poor one yet, have we? They're all inferior. Hmm. Yeah, I meant to rest. Mm. The tools aren't really great either, I guess. have a hand axe, but it says a carving axe would be better. It's not really surprising, though. There you go, Bob. Do we still have any more of that bear? Looks like we're out of bear. Something I never thought I would say, really. Looks like we're out of bear. Hmm. Can probably get one more done today. I think tomorrow I'm gonna check the traps again, because it's been a little while. hasn't been that long real time, but in the game we've spent a few days just sitting here making these traps. Yes, I want to leave Bob here. Not 
too interested in getting more blueberries right now. We have quite a lot at the house. Huh, nothing. That's disappointing. Do we have, um, the favorableness of the trap? Yes. I've been seeing a lot of animals lately. Guess it's just not a good month for them. I'm seeing small ones, but nothing big. Oh well. We have a good supply of food for now. Not overly concerned by it. Actually, that meat we had smoking should prob probably be almost done. So, before I finish that... Yeah, most of it's done. Yeah, we're definitely not running low on food by any means. We have a lot. We haven't even started in on our dehydrated food from the beginning of the LP. Or beginning of the character, rather. I think we had one or two characters die in the early episodes. Oh, we finally got a poor one. It's not really a good thing, but we got one. Yay? Question mark? I'm sitting in the same place too much. My recording software is duplicating a ton of frames because there's not enough different between a lot of them. Yeah, I think we're getting poor ones because we started in on our inferior boards. Poor boards, yeah. <laughs> That's fine. Just gonna sleep out in the open. Eat that bob. I'll refill this. Did I drop those? No. And we're almost out of boards, finally. I've been doing this for like 18 minutes now. This is not going to be an entertaining episode, I guess. Sorry. It's our last board, though. No, don't select everything. I went to page down. So, what do we have? 20 good ones, 16 inferior, and 7 poor. Okay. It's not actually very good, but we'll do for now. I only have one thunder tree trunk. That's not great. And only 13 rocks. Hmm. Might have to go out and gather some more materials. How long have 
take is going to take shortly, hour, few hours, and late afternoon. Okay. Withering and will die in two weeks. Damn. Yeah, I guess we didn't plant those on time. That sucks. Oh well. Gonna cut down some slender trees, young trees, whatever they're called. And we need to pick up some rocks. Branches we can get easily enough. Not much to say about this, really. It's another busy work episode, basically. A lot of annoying little things that need to get done. Right, that should be more than enough. Okay, now that was a bleat, not Bob barking. So I guess we're going to have to wait till next year for an actual harvest, which sucks because that's one of the challenge goals, I think. It's way down there though, somewhere. Not to it. I thought it was. Hmm. Guess not. Oh well. It should last a little while. Probably going to make them into spears. But I'm not sure. Should probably make at least one grain flail. to the cellar and then go to bed. Mm. 
Mm, sounds like Bob's not happy. There you go, Bob. I don't think you can climb a fence while halting. I don't think you can push things through the fence. Can you? Oh, I guess you can. Okay, that was a bit buggy, I guess. I was trying to climb the fence and it thought I was still hauling things, even though I had already pushed all of the stuff I was hauling under the fence. So, that was a bit awkward. Alright. So how much food do we have on us? Oh, I forgot to drop off those rocks, too. Alright, let's go, Bob. We need to find some food. We don't need to, per se, but I would like to. Um, wolf. No thanks. Leash Bob Barker. That will never not be funny to me. Attack that hair. Now I just need to find them. Where'd you go, Bob? Don't even see tracks. He's barking in this general direction. Come on, Bob, bark again. Come on, Bob, where are you? Here I am. still be chasing it, could he? So 
Not that slow, is he? Please don't be that slow, Bob. Find it, Bob. Guess he lost it. Oh well, let's go. Lost or he ate it. If he ate it, I don't really mind. Hmm. I haven't really gone up to see the Seal Tribe at all, have we? I think with the new trading system that might actually be a good idea. Not right now, of course, because we don't even have anything to trade with them with us, but... It would be a good idea sometime soon. And it's too dark to see anything from the mountains. So, let's go home. No, Bob can't fly. Hmm. That would be neat, actually. Getting pets that could fly. I wonder if, um, large animals are harder to find in this version. Guess it would make sense. Because I don't think we've actually seen, like, an elk or anything. Oh, we already have a grain flow. So, I'm not really sure what to do. I guess just make some spears for now. Because we need more stuff to trade. No, I guess you can't make them in that large a quantity. episode's running a little bit longer than I expected it to. But I kind of want to get most of the busy work out of the way. That way we can go and go adventuring in the next one. I think 30 stabs should be enough. That gives us, what, 30 spears, 20 fox traps. Wait till that punt, too. I don't think we really need it. My headphones are starting to hurt again. I guess Bob's hungry again. <coughs> hungry, Bob? 
Aufgaben. Hopefully this will be enough for at least a knife and probably some grain. That's basically what I'm hoping for from our next trip to town. Actually, try to trade that punt in, and see if we can't get a cow or something. But the punt is really useful for getting around, so I'm not sure that's really a good idea. It's better than hauling a raft. I'll have to think about that one. But a cow would be a pretty decent pack animal. Bob's hungry again. Shut up, Bob. Alright, so we're out of staves and we got three javelins. Not bad. rocks. So can we ca carry all of this? Yep. Do I have one more? Yep. So, I'm going to call it here, and next time hopefully we'll get into town and trade for some things that are worth having. I'll see you next time guys, bye!